Hello everybody, welcome back. Hope everyone's having a great day today. Today is week 10 of the Fantasy Rip League, and I am facing off against Eddie with at um, Spurs, Car Spurs Cards 21, and I'm going to be ripping into a mega box and a fat pack of Absolute Football. I found these out in the wild at Target, and was very surprised to find it, and was really excited because I haven't ripped any Absolute yet. If you're new to... Um, watching the Fantasy Rip League. Um, we build teams out of what we rip. And however they, the players score in Fantasy Football, that's how many points we get. There are multipliers. So um, the multipliers are like for base cards, it's times one, parallel times two, numbered times three, and so on and so forth. So for example, if I were to pull a one of one of Sam Darnold and he were to get negative two points, then I would have negative 20 points on the game. So that's why I won't be playing Sam Donald because he's not that good. So we'll uh, be ripping into this. And I'm going to start off with the Fat Pack. And the Fat Pack has 20 cards in it. I'm not sure about what parallels are in this. So we'll get ripping in and we'll find out. Looking for uh, Kansas City Chiefs for the PC, and also some of the top rooks. If you haven't seen what Absolute look like yet, um, which I imagine a lot of you probably have, I'm a little late on opening it. This is what they look like. This is the front. And this is the back. So we got a Khalil Mack. He could be a good defensive player to play. Uh, Keenan Allen could be a good wide receiver. Put him up there just in case. Alvin Kamara, put him in a running back spot. Nick Chubb, who's out for the season, unfortunately. We have Josh Jacobs, another good running back. Aaron Jones could be a good wide receiver. Wait, running back, sorry. <laughs> Uh, Matt Ryan could be a decent quarterback. Marvin Jones could be a possible wide receiver with a multiplier because since he's a green parallel, uh, that would be the uh, have a multiplier on it. Um, not sure if I want to play him though. Got a Tredavious White, a defensive player. So, possible defense. Sure, why this is backwards? Got oh, Green Neville Gilmore. He is a defensive tackle with Dallas, so don't want to play him. C.D. Lamb inter introductions. Quentin Nelson and Sung Heroes. And our rookies is absolute is loaded with rookies. You have a Russ Blacklock, James Morgan. Which honestly, I'm surprised he hasn't had any start time with. Donald Bean out, and with Flacco being past his prime. I'm surprised they haven't thrown him in just to see how he does. Um, Anthony Gordon, Jordan Brooks, Colin Johnson, Lynn Bowden Jr., Eno Benjamin, and the last one is Joe Reed. So none of the uh, top rooks in that pack. But we already have a lot of stuff in our lineup. Um, for the blaster box, not blaster, mega box, we have 10 cards per pack, four packs per box, and you find one rookie autograph and one memorabilia card per box on average. So from what I've seen of these, um, none of the autographs have been too amazing. Um, but I haven't seen... Probably enough of these ripped to really have a good enough comparison. Um, it seems like I heard someone say that they've seen good autos pulled out of this, but I can't remember. I might be thinking of, um, I just be thinking of Prestige. Um, because, I mean, the Mega Boxes is the only way to get the autos because there is no hobby of Prestige. Um, let's get this open. Try not to tear up the boxes. I like saving, um, one box from each project, product. Got the packs out. 
And let's see what we get. First pack. This has our memorabilia card in it. Don't want to take a chance of hurting the cards. <laughs> We have an Austin Eckler, Aaron Jones again, Matt Ryan again. Oh, gonna expose the uh, memorabilia card right off the bat. A Jerry Judy, orange um, piece of memorabilia. That's pretty cool um, compared to the uh, uh, normal white you see. That's pretty neat. Um, rookie Force. Is he wide receiver? He's wide receiver. I'll put him up there because he could possibly be good to play, even though Denver has just been terrible this year, unfortunately. Um, he's a possi um, possible uh, card. He's got a red Travis Kelsey, so that's awesome. That'd be a times two multiplier. Got a um, Quintez Cephas. A Jake Lutton, AJ Terrell, John Hightower the fourth, and a Noah Noah that guy. I'm just gonna say that. Oh, just saw a decent rookie on the back of there. Let's see if this is our okay. Our auto's not in this pack. Got an Adam Thielen. Le'Veon Bell, now with the Chiefs. Kenny Galladay. Josh Allen, who has been playing incredible lately. Anthony Miller. Russell Wilson. And our rookies are J.K. Dobbins. Xavier McKinney. Jeremy Chin, and Cam Akers, who I believe is still injured, but still a good rookie card. Unfortunately, there's a little nick up there, so won't be able to get that one submitted. Pack number three. This is our auto. Don't want to expose it. Move it to the back. Got a Jalen Hurts rookie red. It's pretty cool. Keyshawn Vaughn. He could be a good defensive player. Wait, he's a running back. Never mind. <laughs> I was thinking of uh, someone else. Can't remember who I was thinking of. But got DJ J G DJ Dallas. Patrick Queen. Now that could be a good defense. Jake Fromm, Ryan Tannehill, Von Miller, Larry Fitz, oh. Mike Gusecki, and our auto is Juan Jennings with San Francisco. It's numbered out of 75. That's pretty cool looking. Not familiar with Juan Jennings. I'll have to look him up. That penny sleeve real quick. Really cool looking card though. Let's see what he's doing. I'm not sure if I'll be able to use that autograph or not because I haven't, honestly haven't heard of him at all. So I'm not sure if he's really getting any play time. Last pack, we have a Scary Terry McLaurin. A Deshaun Jackson. Russell Wilson. T.Y. Hilton. Got a gold Michael Thomas. And I have no idea when he's going to be returning. And it seems like he's going to return and then he's injured or he's suspended or just 
there's just a bunch going on with him, so I have no idea when he's playing, when, he's, when he'll be coming back. Got an Isaac Bruce. That's pretty cool. Fantasy flashbacks. AJ Epineza. Ben DiNucci, who's injured. Justin Jefferson. That's a could be a good card to play. And a Daryl Taylor. So I'm going to pause this real quick, and I'm going to see uh, what my options are and get my team ready. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I got my lineup all set up. And after much consideration, I decided not to use my autograph because he's not with the team anymore. And apparently the 49ers cut him and he's just a free agent. Um, so a really cool autograph. And I like how he has number on there and everything, but a little hard to play somebody that's uh, not playing. On the bright side, at least he wouldn't get me negative points, but I had too many other options I could use. For my quarterback, I'm going to be playing Russell Wilson. My first uh, wide receiver, I'm going to play this red parallel of Michael Thomas. I was wrong. He was back last week, but only got 10 points. Um, hoping he does better this week. So he can get me some decent points. Um, for my memorabilia card, I got... I'm going to be using my... For a memorabilia card. For my second wide receiver, I'm going to use my memorabilia card of Jerry Judy. Um, usually isn't the, doesn't get a ton of fantasy points, but with the four, um, times four multiplier, it should be a, um, it could work out for my tight end. As much as I wanted to use my red Travis Kelsey, wasn't able to because he's on a buy. So instead I'm going with this red Mike Gusecki and the dolphins have been tearing it up lately. So hopefully, um, he gets some good points this week. For my first running back, I'm going to be using Aaron Jones, just the base. So, no multiplier there. My second running back, I'm going to be using Alvin Kamara. And again, just the base. My kicker or defensive player, I'm using Khalil Mack. And last for my um, defensive player, I'm using, um, or my defense, I'm using Patrick Queen or Baltimore's defense. And I had the times two multiplier with Buffalo, but um, they're facing off against the Cardinals this week. And so I just don't really like the matchup for them and their defense, it's okay at best. And Baltimore is just tearing it up. So um, I'm gonna play Patrick Queen um, or the Baltimore defense is my defense. So that's my lineup. Um, good luck to Eddie. Um, anxious to see what you have for your lineup. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, hit the like button also. And leave a comment down below. Enjoy communicating with everybody. Getting to know everyone. Uh, my next video is going to be on Thursday for Triple Play Thursday. I'm going to be ripping into a mega box of um, Bowman... Bowman... Um, hmm. Let me check. Of Bowman Platinum... <laughs> So we're going to be ripping into that and also going to be ripping a regular hobby pack of uh, 2020 Bowman just to get the rip started. And so really looking forward to that rip. It's a brand new product. And um, from what I've heard, it doesn't have the best stuff in there, but never know. I could get I could get lucky. You never know. And so just looking forward to ripping into that. So make sure you turn into that video so you can see that. Um, so yeah, I hope everyone enjoyed the video and... Have a great rest of your day. Take care, stay healthy. Until next time, later.